My name's uh, Rusty Parker. I work for Parker Brothers Construction, and um, we're laying uh, aerated concrete material on this particular house. It's a concrete material that has air pumped into it, and then it's baked and cut. It has high acoustical um, values and uh, insulating values as well. It thin sets in, so it's, it's pretty easy to work with. So by thin set, what do you mean? How, how's it different from, let's see, concrete block? Anyway. Concrete block will use a mortar joint, and your mortar joints can vary in thickness. It can, they're usually a quarter to three-eighths inch thick. If they start to get off anywhere down the wall, they can start to build that up. With this, since it's a thin set, it's a very, our, our mortar joints with thin set are only about an eighth of an inch thick which means that we need to be precise all the way. Uh, we not only have to start off right, we have to keep right going up the, through the whole structure. Okay, and what is it, what, what, what do you normally deal with? What's your uh, normally I'm a tile guy, and, okay. and my company's name is Parker Tile. Um, and normally we lay tile, but because of the, because this requires a little bit more exactness, um, they traditionally use um, either Tile guys are really, really good carpenters. There are other brick masons uh, who are installing this type of material, um, but they're 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 high quality uh, masons. What are the challenges as far as uh, uh, trying to learn how to do this from scratch? This is your first project, right? Oh yeah, this is absolutely the first project. <laughs> what, what? Um, just. I guess I worry more than anything because, you know, it has to be right going up. It has to be level. Um, and, and getting that and keeping that as we're going and, and trying to do a reasonable amount of work in a day without making it look like you haven't, go like you've been, haven't been goofing off all day, <laughs> I guess would be the biggest, biggest challenge. Okay. So I, I, we're, we're learning a lot of stuff as we go on this house and a lot of stuff we'd, we would um, – like to do for the next one and so forth just to make it just to make installing it easier is it uh, hard to handle or is it easy to handle what are your impressions at the end of the day when you're getting tired they can be kind of heavy um but it, but it's not it's not that bad but they're uh, substantially less heavy than a concrete block correct yes they're just a little more bulkier because they're uh these are eight by eights by 24 um, so it, it takes a little bit, um, you have to have both hands to put them in because of, of their, of their length. Okay. And so you look forward to using the product again, you think? Is this something you'll... Yeah. Yeah. We, we've got another house. Uh, we know for sure that we're using it. Uh, I'm probably going to use this on the addition in my house in the future. Um, because because of the insulating values of it and so forth because it, it is so easy to work with 